In this video, we discuss the increasing incidence of colorectal cancer in people under 55 and emphasize the importance of understanding its early signs for all ages. Despite feeling invincible, younger individuals are also at risk, highlighting the need for awareness and action. The American Cancer Society's statistics show that colorectal cancer is amongst the most common cancers. The rates have been decreasing overall, but rising in those under 55. Survival rates vary by stage with early detection, significantly improving outcomes. This video stresses the importance of regular screenings and prompt medical attention if symptoms arise, as early detection can greatly impact prognosis. Let's explore the 11 early signs of colorectal cancer. Number one, change in bowel habits. So picture this, you've been noticing some changes lately, maybe more trips to the bathroom or constipation that's out of the norm. It's easy to shrug it off, but these changes could be trying to tell you something important. You see, sometimes these shifts could signal something serious like colorectal cancer, especially if they stick around. But here's the good news. Catching it early can make all the difference. So don't hesitate to reach out to a healthcare provider. It might just save the day and your life. Number two, blood in the stool. Imagine you're going about your day when you notice something concerning, blood in your stool. It's not something you expected, and it's definitely not something you want to ignore. You see, blood in the stool can sometimes be a sign of colorectal cancer, especially if it's happening regularly or without an obvious cause like hemorrhoids. But here's the thing, catching it early can be a game changer. So instead of brushing it off, take a moment to reach out to a healthcare provider. They can help you figure out what's going on and take the right steps to keep you healthy. Don't hesitate, your well-being is worth it. Number three, narrow stool. Imagine this scenario. You've been paying attention to your bathroom habits lately and something catches your eye. Your stool seem narrower than usual. It's not something you'd noticed before and it's got you a bit concerned. Well, here's the thing. Narrow stools, especially if they persist, could be trying to tell you something important. You see, in some cases, they could be an early sign of colorectal cancer. But don't panic just yet. Catching it early can make a world of difference. So don't brush it off, and by now you know what to do next. If you like this video, please consider hitting the like button, share this video, and subscribe. It really helps us out a lot and motivates us in bringing you more quality content. Number four, feeling of incomplete emptying. Let's set the scene. You're finishing up in the bathroom, but something doesn't quite feel right. You still have the sensation of not quite emptying your bowels completely. It's a strange feeling and it's been happening more often than usual. Well, here's the thing. That sensation of incomplete emptying could be a signal your body is trying to send you. In some cases, it might even be an early sign of colorectal cancer. But don't worry just yet, catching these signs early can be a lifesaver. Number five, fatigue and weakness. Picture this, you're going about your day, but lately you've been feeling more tired and weaker than usual. It's not just the usual fatigue. It's like your body is struggling to keep up with the demands of daily life. Well, here's something to consider. Fatigue and weakness, especially if they persist, could be more than just a passing phase. Sometimes they can be early signs of colorectal cancer. But don't let that overwhelm you. Catching it early can make all the difference. So instead of pushing through and ignoring the signs, it might be worth reaching out to a healthcare provider. They can help you figure out what's going on and guide you towards the best steps for your health. Number six, unintentional weight loss. You've been noticing a change in your body lately. 
You're losing weight without really trying. It's not the result of a new diet or exercise routine. It's just happening on its own. Well, here's the thing. Unintentional weight loss, especially if it's significant and unexplained, could be a signal your body is sending you. And sometimes it could be an early sign of colorectal cancer. But before you panic, remember this. Catching it early can make all the difference. Instead of brushing off the weight loss as a fluke, consider reaching out to a healthcare provider. Number seven, abdominal discomfort. Let's imagine this scenario. You've been experiencing discomfort in your abdomen lately. Maybe it's a dull ache, bloating, or cramping that just won't go away. It's not severe enough to stop you in your tracks, but definitely noticeable. Well, here's the thing. Abdominal discomfort, especially if it's persistent, could be your body's way of signaling something important. In some cases, it might even be an early sign of colorectal cancer. But don't let that scare you. Catching it early can make a world of difference. So instead of brushing off the discomfort, consider reaching out to a healthcare provider. Number eight, anemia. Let's dive into this scenario. You've been feeling more tired than usual lately, and you notice that your skin looks paler than normal. Maybe you're experiencing dizziness or shortness of breath. Well, here's something to consider. This could be signs of anemia, a condition where your body doesn't have enough healthy red blood cells to carry adequate oxygen to your tissues. But here's the twist. Anemia can sometimes be an early sign of colorectal cancer. Now, don't let that worry you too much. Catching it early can make a big difference. So instead of ignoring the signs, consider reaching out to a healthcare provider. But you already know that, right? Number nine, lump in abdomen or rectum. When someone has colorectal cancer, a lump in the abdomen or rectum can be an early sign. This happens because the cancer cells grow and form a mass or tumor. Inside the colon or rectum, where the cancer starts, these cells multiply and create a lump that can be felt from the outside. This lump might not cause pain at first, which is why it's important to pay attention to any changes in your body. If you notice a lump or any unusual changes in your abdomen or rectum, it's essential to see a doctor right away. Early detection and treatment can improve your chances of recovery. Number 10, swollen lymph nodes. Let's paint a picture. You've noticed some swelling in your neck, armpits, or groin lately. It's not painful, but it's definitely there. Well, here's something to consider. Those swollen lymph nodes could be trying to tell you something important. Lymph nodes are small bean-shaped glands that play a crucial role in your immune system, helping to fight off infections and diseases. But sometimes swelling in these nodes can be a sign that your body is responding to something more serious, like colorectal cancer. Now, don't panic just yet. Catching it early can make all the difference. So instead of ignoring the swelling, consider reaching out to a healthcare provider. Number 11, fluid buildup in the abdomen, ascites. Picture this, you start noticing that your abdomen feels swollen and bloated, even though you haven't gained weight. This swelling could be due to a buildup of fluid in the abdomen, a condition called ascites. Ascites can occur when cancer spreads to the lining of the abdomen or liver, interfering with the body's ability to regulate fluid. It's essential to address ascites promptly as it can lead to discomfort and complications. If you experience abdominal swelling, it's wise to consult with a healthcare provider to determine the cause and appropriate management. In summary, these early signs that we discussed can all be early signs of colorectal cancer. And if you're experiencing them, well, I know you know what to do next.